Hello, Pisces. How are you guys? Now, listen, Pisces, when it comes down to love, you guys really have to stop being honest, okay? Those of you that are in a relationship, it is time for you to be honest, okay? Be honest about your feelings that you have towards each other. It's time for you to start sitting down and having heart-to-heart -heart conversations as well, okay? Also, Geminis, you also need to start making the effort for love to be in relationships as well, okay? Know that when you're just talking to somebody, like really make the effort to get to know people as well, okay? Great love is worth taking the step, the steps, steps okay that you're guided to take so please make the effort pisces make the effort put forth the effort also pisces know this know your worth pisces know your worth know that you are worth waiting for as well even when it comes down to relationships don't rush into a relationship wait on the right timing Wait on the right timing. Right now, if you're single, you need to wait on the right timing. While you're waiting, love yourself first. Love you. So when you get in a relationship, you won't lose yourself in that relationship. You will still be you. Have your life, your likes, your wants, your desires, your pleasures, the things that you enjoy. So you won't lose yourself in that person, Pisces. Okay, but love yourself first. Start doing more stuff for yourself as well. That there is what is going to keep them attracted to you. Okay, take care of yourself. Also, Gemini's, you got to learn how to compromise. Okay, compromise when you're in a relationship. Compromise, make the effort. Compromise, work together as a team. Okay, compromise with each other. Even when it comes down to their feelings, sit down, talk about it, learn how to compromise. Okay. Pisces. Okay, Leos. Now, when it comes to you, Leos, pertaining to love, listen, Leos, know that you all are ready. You are ready to take the next steps, okay? You are ready. But also, Leos, know that there is some forgiving, some reconciliation, Look at that reconciliation that is being taking place, okay? And this here is someone that you have dated in your past. Know that it's like they're going to be returning back into your life as well. So know that an ex will be returning back into your life, Leo. Like forgive, okay? Forgive. Also, Leos, it's like forgive, okay? You It is time for you to start forgiving people and learning, Okay, when it comes down to love, forgive people. Let go of the past hurt. Okay, let go of the past hurt, the past hurt, the bad experience. Okay, let go of the past hurt that you had in relationships. Things did not work out. So it's time for you to let go. Forgive, release, and let go. So you can start enjoying the present moments in love. Even when it comes down to an ex returning back into your life. Forgive. Learn. Just like this. Forgive. Let go and let God. Okay? Forgive, let go, and let God. It's like you are ready to forgive. You are ready to move on. You are ready to love again. It's like you are ready. Okay? Leos, I see a lot of engagements that's going on right now as well. It's like there is so much love going on with you guys that's already in a relationship to where it's going to be a higher level of commitment as well, even when it comes down to putting a ring on it. Okay? So know that, Leos, there are going to be rings being put on it as well. Okay? Also, know this, Leos. Know that you deserve love. Know that you are a lovable person. Okay? Know that you have a lot to give when it comes down to love. You just don't want to be treated wrong. You want love. You want people to love you and respect you for you as well. You want people to be honest with you as also. Listen, forgive those that hurt you, Leo. Forgive and let it go. Don't take that with you to the next relationship, okay? 
Don't let the new relationship pay for what the last person did to you in a relationship. Okay? So stay focused on your love. Stay focused on you as well. Know that you deserve to be loved also. Know that there's going to be a lot of engagements happening for you, Leos, as well. Okay? Like you all are growing in the relationships that you already have. Also, know this, Leos, that someone from your past will be trying to come back into your life. Not only come back, but someone from your past is coming back into your life as in a relationship as well. And therefore, it is time for you to forgive and let go. Okay? Forgive and let go. Even when it comes down to you, Leos, forgive yourself as well. Okay? For your past mistakes in the relationship that you had as well. Okay? That's right. Forgive yourself for the mistakes that you have done in the relationships from the past and let go. Like, learn from your past mistakes. Leos, let go and let God. Okay, know that you Leos are ready to love again. You guys are ready. Okay, Leos. Hello, Taurus. This is what you need to know when it pertains to love for you, Taurus. You guys need to stop putting trust in the person that you are with. Start trusting the person that you are with. Okay, Taurus, and not only start trusting the people that you are with, but you need to start trusting yourself also, okay? Stop paying attention to other people's emotions, Taurus. Pay attention to other people's feelings as well. It is time for you to start having faith and trust in yourself and with the person that you are in a relationship with, Taurus. Okay? Taurus also know that to be patient, okay? Know that you are worth waiting for. Even when it comes down to your love life, don't rush it, okay? Be patient and work on yourself, Taurus, and heal from the past when it comes down to you waiting for the perfect person to be in your life as well. Keep God in your relationship also, people. Taurus also know this when it comes down to love. There's some issues with finances, bills, monies, jobs, careers as well. Okay. And your financial issues are playing a factor in your love life right now. Okay. But there's no need to worry. Keep the Lord Jesus Christ, God, the creator of heaven and earth in your relationship. Okay. Pray. Always pray. Pray. Know that it is safe for you to love Taurus. It is safe. Open your heart to give and receive love. The best love. Okay? Not just a little bitty love. You got that trust issue. You got to break down that trust issue, Taurus, and give your all. Give, give all your heart. Give it all. Okay, Taurus? There's no need to worry. Okay? Pray always, ask the Lord to help you with your financial situation as well, because that is playing a factor in your love life right now, okay? But start trusting each other. Keep the Lord first in, in it all, okay? And things are going to get better for you, Taurus, okay? Know that there is something better on the horizon. So keep the faith, Taurus. Keep the faith. God bless you all. Hello, Aries. When it comes to you pertaining to love, start doing more for yourself, Aries, okay? Like your relationships, your love life, your love, your relationships are being affected by many things, okay? Children, for one. OK, um, right now it's like they're home now and they're, you know, they're blocking a lot of things, um, Aries. But your relationships, your love life is being affected by children, not only affected by children, but it's also being affected by money issues. OK, and um, 
job related issues as well okay even when it comes down to bills a lot it's like you you have to start asking people for help start asking others for help aries okay don't let things get so piled up on top of you to where you be forgetting about love okay you guys got to start seeing the bigger picture start seeing the bigger picture also okay know that there's a lot of attraction that's getting ready to happen for you all aries all right. Um, you're gonna be attra attracting your your relationship, not your relationship, but the person you are supposed to be with, enjoying them as well. But listen, there's gonna be new people coming into your life, Aries. Enjoy them, okay? Enjoy them, even the ones that you are with now. Enjoy them. Spend time with them as well. Start doing more with the person that you are with in a relationship, Aries. Okay. And for those of you that are single, listen, you have to start praying and asking the Lord for what it is that you want, okay? What type of person do you want? Be very detailed about the person that you really want to be with, Aries, and let the Lord know so he can bring that together. And not only just the Lord, but start asking friends for help also. Ask help. Ask for help from others. Even if you say, listen, friend, you got some, do you know anybody that's single? Do your boyfriend have a friend? Do they have a friend? Okay. You also have to start paying attention to the red flags, Aries. Okay. Pay attention to the red flags. It's like there's a lot of red flags going on with you now in the relationship. You see it. You see the red flags. Okay, Aries, be caution, caution, caution. Pay attention to them. Okay, pay attention to the red flags that you are getting from the person that you are in a relationship with. Okay, start asking others for, for help. Even start asking the Lord for help as well. Okay. Know that your relationship is being affected by money, job, jobs, your finances, your bills. That there is affecting, is playing a big factor in your relationship, in your love life right now. Okay? Start praying and asking the Lord for what it is you want. Start doing more when it comes down to Aries wanting to be in a relationship. Start being more attractive. Start doing more attracting things as well. Okay? And when you're in a relationship, Aries, do more with that person. Okay? Do more for that person so they can see the love that you have for them. And not only that, Aries, but you have to communicate with the person that you are with as well and start letting them know that they need to start showing you better than telling you. Okay, Aries? And don't forget to ask for, for help from the Lord. Don't forget to ask for help from others, Aries. Aries. 